Brian here with HelpSellMyRV.com out of Louisville, Kentucky, where all RVs are for sale by owner. I'm going to do a walk around on this beautiful, fully loaded 2016 Forest River Cedar Creek Cottage 40 CRS wide body triple slide travel trailer. Go ahead and get started on the inside and then finish up by showing you the outside. Fortunately, we're inside and uh, this is where the coach stays when not in use. The coach has only been used six times. It is the second owner. And the only reason why the owners bought it, they bought it to build a house and they ended up not selling their current house. So they don't need the trailer. So they actually bought the trailer for no reason at all. <laughs> but anyway, it is in excellent condition. Overall exterior length is 41 feet, six inches. Exterior height to the dual large 15,000 BTU AC units is 12 feet, 10 inches. Give you an idea of the floor plan here before I get started. This has got a lot of uh, park model features. The huge panoramic, huge windows in the rear here. I'll show that to you on the outside. Kind of looks like a park model on the outside, but uh, uh, and also the tongue. Hope I don't forget. But the tongue on the outside actually you can disconnect it. So if you want to keep it in a permanent like lake lot and build a patio around the trailer, you can do that. All right. This is a triple slide. Uh, let's start off on the living room slide out and then I'll work my way around beautiful floor plan by the way First slide out is going to be definitely a super slide. It's going to be at least 12 foot long and Three foot deep accommodates the freestanding table and chairs and the double lazy boy rocker recliners and they are ultra leather and all the fabrics in this camper are in showroom excellent condition uh, as far as what the owners are telling me it has only been used six times and that was with the original owners uh, the current owners have never used it There's nice storage areas up underneath the seats and kind of show off those fabrics uh, it's gonna be like a tan kind of corduroy look and again showroom excellent condition it's got like a add a leaf you can pull this out I do want to point out this is again fully loaded the only thing this coach does not have is a stackable washer and dryer this is washer and dryer prepped uh, this does have the dual pane windows that was a big uh, option dual pane windows or the thermal pane windows and it does have the MCD roller blinds basically day shades for day and then the total blackouts roller blinds these are the ones you want these are the best blinds you can get hands down on the market and again, all dual pane thermal pane windows. And the insulation on this coach is uh, R38 in the floor, triple insulated. So you can actually uh, live up north in this if you wanted to. It can definitely withstand the cold weather. You do have 12 volt heat pads on every single holding tank. All right, how to bed, ultra leather, lazy boy sleeper sofa. It's the pullout out of bed queen bed and let's go ahead and show you the lazy boy tag right there or badge uh, tags are still on pretty much everything uh, the fans have not even been taken out of the box the ceiling fans they're still in the box and I'll show that to you in the master bedroom okay this is going to be the second slide out. Definitely another super slide. It accommodates the entertainment center area all the way to the uh, upgraded 20 cubic foot residential refrigerator by Whirlpool, which I'll show you. Fireplace. It's going to be like a 5,000 BTU heating source here. And I believe it's, yeah, it is remote control. And you do have uh, Jensen stereo, all Bluetooth smart device ready you can hook it up to any smart device and you're ready to rock and roll kind of like a sound bar here it does have home theater surround sound it's gonna be another uh, Jensen product here I believe they're calling this a 48 inch flat screen kind of back up here and show off that maple glaze finish cabinets on this coach are gonna be some of the best you're gonna find in in a camper 
solid surface, coin style countertops. It's kind of like a marble. Beautiful backsplash, by the way, and I think that was new for 2016. Solid backsplash for easy cleanup. And you do have the three burner gas cooktop. Front burner is usually a high output, nice glass cover for more counter space. And this is going to be a convection oven. It looks like a huge convection oven uh, by Whirlpool. There's your Whirlpool badge right there. And I do want to point out there is an oven right down here. It's a little dirty. The trailer is dirty. It has not been detailed whatsoever, but uh, it should shine up like a new penny. Show off those cabinets. It's going to be your island kitchen here. I almost forgot the coolest part of the kitchen dishwasher with stainless steel finish show that out there to you here we go and your island kitchen solid surface Korean style uh, countertops and this double bowl stainless steel sink with covers pull out spare faucet around back up here kind of show that off there's your stool 110 outlet right there on the island this little accent lighting down there beautiful lighting by the way in the kitchen all recessed puck lights all LED most of your manufacturers are doing that now you do have central vac here dirt devil central vac 20 cubic foot stainless steel finished refrigerator by Whirlpool. There's your Whirlpool badge right there. And show that off. Does have ice maker. This is electric. There's kind of a hutch area here. Uh, this is a garbage can. Double, I believe. Yep, double garbage can. And this is going to be a little pull out drawer here. And I do want to point out these are soft closing drawers. Again, a lot of residential features on this coach. And this closet right here is going to have all your vacuum cleaner attachments. Uh, this is going to be your monitor panel. Monitor panel here. Pretty easy to figure out. Uh, you can put your slides out. <coughs> and turn on all your lights pretty easy to figure out and your monitor levels here and yeah it's all pretty self-explanatory there uh, i do also want to point out it does have sliding glass patio door and it is thermal pane dual pane going into the hallway here go into the bathroom again solid surface Corn style countertops, even in the bathroom. Nice vanity area with medicine, cabinet, and your shower. One piece residential shower with seating. This is going to be one of the best showers you're going to find in a travel trailer or a fifth wheel. And you do have a you do have, by the way, uh, fantastic vent fans here, and they are remote. Uh, there's actually a switch on the wall here, kind of back up here. There's your switch right there for your fantastic vent fan. And you also have one in the kitchen. Try to show that to you. And I go back. Going into the master bedroom here. Master bedroom has the third slide out. It is the king bed. King bed does lift up. Lots of storage up underneath. This is an ultra plush mattress. I think they're calling it by Serta and let's see here pan around this is going to be where your washer and dryer would go if you wanted that option a lot of people don't do the washer and dryer because you get more storage and that's where your hookups are this is 50 amp service by the way close it here uh, tv never was mounted that's the bedroom tv i'm going to say it's probably like a 
maybe a 28 inch flat screen by Samsung and there's your fans they're not even put together so th this coach has literally only been used from what the owners are telling me uh, six times and there's the ceiling fan that they didn't even put together but I told the owner suggested to have them put them put together they're pretty easy to fit put together there's where your TV would go and it does have the mount hand down here there we go all right speed this video up a little bit oh you do have a laundry chute gotta show that laundry chute right there this is a double door entry by the way and you do have a little peephole there for you as soon as at the door bit for more privacy in the bedroom and last look of the kitchen and living room area beautiful floor plan by the way and this is going to be your thermostat for your heating uh, which is your 40,000 BTU heating source on this coach which is more than enough for a 41 footer this is going to be your control for your fantastic vent fan there it is right there all ducted AC all ducted heat all throughout all right let's go outside 16 inch Dexter axles with easy lube so you can do all your servicing at home let's kind of back up here kind of show off that it's called a pearl gel coat finish pearl in color and it's bled all the way through looks like a full body paint but uh, it is gel coat true gel coat exterior speakers on the outside there's your double door entry from the bedroom to the outside and uh, let's see here oh you do have uh, you do have full uh, eight point heavy duty stabilizer jacks you can park this thing at a lake lot and just leave it kind of come around the front here kind of speed up my videos a little bit show off that front show off that glossy gel coat this tongue detaches kind of come around here and I'll show you where it detaches real quick and you can remove this tongue and it's really it does have a lot of uh, it's more more of a park model feature but if you want to remove the tongue you have that option you cannot do that on traditional RV sorry we're in a tight spot here but can't really get the back side but I'll try my best show off that gel coat finish water heater is gonna be in here it's gonna be a 20 gallon water heater everything else is gonna be 10 to 12 gallon storage compartment right up here by the way service light for hitching two large 30 pound LP tanks battery I did check this coach for delamination bubbling which is that bubbling you get on the outside of the coach caused by water damage did not find any issues uh, condition 1 through 10 10 being the best I definitely would rate this definitely a 10 I think any dealer would agree with me it's underneath the bed by the way and all your compartment doors are all insulated no point dream valve right up underneath there and show up th that underneath the enclosed heated underbelly again r38 insulation triple insulated by the way there's your dump valves they're all protected Let's see if I can show there you go see the dump valves right there your gate valves they're all protected up into the underbelly 50 amp service with the marine style cord unplug roll it up and easy cleanup when you're storing it these are going to be your tv and cable hookups freshwater hookup right here it's going to be your freshwater uh, connection here and uh, this is probably going to be the 120 gallon freshwater uh, holding tank and uh, your gray tank i'm sorry your gray tank is 120 gallons and your fresh water is i believe 76 gallon and your black water which is your toilet i believe it's 40 gallon there's your hydraulic reservoir for your slide outs easy to service there's your water heater uh, I'm sorry your water pump in case you want to winterize you got that right there pretty easy to figure out black tank sewer flush washes out your toilet and that's where you hook up your sewer hose again 16 inch wheels all the tires are in excellent condition there's that cottage by Cedar Creek badge right there good looking little badge there with a the little cabin little house all right show off that gel coat had the owners turn on all the lights on the back side and show off that gel coat finish 
This is going to be your antenna for either your radio, I believe your radio, in the entertainment center in the living room area there. And let me show off the back side here. It kind of looks like a park model from on the rear cap. This is a, a molded rear cap. It's painted and gel coated. And again, at the panoramic style uh, window. Just uh, huge bay windows in the back. And again, they're all thermal paint. I do also want to point out you've got an 18 foot power awning and the power awning has the aluminum shield so when it's put away there's a shield that covers it you know from snow rain UV damage from the Sun kind of back up here see if I can show off 18 foot power awning with the LED lights and all the LEDs work Kind of in a tight spot. It's uh, the owner's got a lot of his toys in this in his shop. Good looking camper. Oh, I do want to point out. Let's back up here. Show off the dual AC units up on top. See if I can show that off there. Eh. But they're two large 15,000 BTU AC units. The living room unit, I believe, is going to have a heat pump. And I believe I got everything. If I didn't, I do apologize. If you want to come and see the camper, just call the number on the ad. You deal directly with the owner. And if you want to keep up to date on RVs coming for sale in the Louisville, Kentucky area, you can always follow HelpSellMyRV.com on Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, and YouTube.